Hi, here is a quick overview to show you how you can easily calculate the blank size for a roll and tuck top, providing length, width, and height. No CAD knowledge needed. Using Arduos CAD, you can access this standard catalog library with hundreds of different designs. I'll also include a PDF file containing this entire library. As you can see, it covers different types such as display bases, headers and trays, as well as standard corrugate boxes and also the RETT roll and tuck top that you requested which I believe is 428 here. 427, let's see. Yes, right there. After selecting the proper standard, we simply select the board material, whether it's corrugate or folding carton. Notice here on the right hand side again, we have a library of different materials included. The only thing you have to do right here is specify length, width, and depth. Notice we can go to the next or previous tab to also specify cover values slot and tab, flaps, or any other parameters in case you want to change these. You can also always rebuild this design if needed. And the blank size is revealed here as 2,439 square inches. That's how easy that was. Now, two options are available. The first one is a 3D option in case you need to visualize this in a 3D fashion. A simple click on that 3D button will generate a 3D model for you. And then you can select the different creases. And using the slider, you can neatly fold up this design. Here, we're picking a 90 degree fold. And again, one last click on this crease line to fold it will show me the three-dimensional representation of this design. Keep in mind, this is optional. A second option I would like to highlight is our intelligent layout tools, which is the cost calculation option, which gives you the opportunity to also calculate more in detail what the total order will cost. For example, let's say we're going to need 12,000 of these shippers. We can enter ink coverage. Let's say we are going to print on this box with the uh, cyan, magenta, yellow, and black process colors. Um, if we know the coverage, of these inks, we can specify it right here to be part of this calculation. This is information you could obtain in Adobe Illustrator, for example, where the graphics will be applied. We can have additional prompted values, cost breakdown as far as die, printing press, window, shipping costs can be entered in here, um, and then the final total cost breakdown. So again, keep in mind these last two options uh, are not necessary to calculate the blank width. Hope that helps. Thank you.